Hello everyone, Mark here, Mark's Max Muscle, and you are looking at the first call out for the Detroit Pro 2024? Well, there is only six athletes, so this is everyone from Gabrielle Gary P to good old Ronald Gordon. Ron Gordon looked awesome. And then of course we have Good Vito and Martin Fitzwater in the uh, center. We have Justin Rodriguez who, well, I think you can see from this photo. We'll take a look at a closer shot of the top two here in a second. But to round off your top six, we have Harry Harris. So everybody looked pretty good. But aside from that, ladies and gentlemen, this is an awesome stage. The lighting was just perfect. You have the screen above the guys. It's like I want to clap. Somebody finally gets it. So, Fuad Obiad's the man. He's the man. But anyway, anyway, congratulations to all these guys for bringing some great condition. But more particular, in particular, the top two, Martin Fitzwater and Good Vito. This is an awesome show. This is a great little rivalry. I mean, these guys look awesome on stage. Both of these two dudes. I mean, who do you got in the front double? I mean, these are just screenshots, of course, but... Man, oh man, if you watch the, I'll link you to the, the live stream, things of that nature. If you're watching it, I mean, you can probably see that these guys are both different condition, but pretty close condition. Front double, I'd probably go with uh, maybe good veto. Good veto. Vitaly Yogolnikov. Front lat spread is a uh, Peckham as well. I mean, good veto. He has the width. He has the striations in those quads. That's very impressive. Martin Fitzwater, maybe not. But like I said, you watch the video and he is conditioned. He is conditioned. Maybe more of an aesthetic look. But still, good veto, probably winning out of the front. Now, when they turn to the side, I notice this is where Martin Fitzwater, he really comes into his own. Now, good veto, he still had the, you know, the cuts and the quads, things of that nature. Good calves as well. But you look at the upper body, and Martin Fitzwater, great big man's manly chest. And I love the Chromius Domius, taking nothing away from the, the top, uh, the head of a uh, good Vito. Foolishness, foolishness. Turn around, and this could be debatable. Good Vito looks good and wide. Good, no pun intended. But Martin Fitzwater, very thick. And three-dimensional in the lat, so it's one versus the other in that sense. And good veto, man, does he have some rock-hard separation. The lower half, it is different condition, but similar condition. What a battle. Like I said, I wasn't joking around. I'm not messing around. Rear lat spread? Hmm, Martin looks good and thick. It looks good and wide as well. And good veto... Too many goods. Great Vito, he, the great Martin. Uh, the good Vito is back. It's like he's not opening up. Like I mentioned before, he's he's Phil Heathing it. He's holding it that way on purpose to create more separation. And look at the lower half on this big stud. Same with Martin. Martin is awesome too. Wow. Side tricep. And this is going to be a hard one for the judges. I mean, Martin Fitzwater, you look at it and you think, okay, he's winning, he's winning. And then you look at Good Vito and you think, okay, no, no, I, I think he's winning, he's winning. Muscle wise, again, you look at Martin, his delts, a tricep, ah, quads, hanging hamstring. They're good, they're both good. And the abs and thigh, I'd probably go with Good Vito. I mean, there's not many shots that I'm saying, so sing, that I'm going for one guy or the other. But man, oh man, man, oh man, this is going to be a tight one. And the most muscular, of course, could be, you guessed it, could be either which one of these two dudes. It is that close. I mean, from the front double to the final shot, Martin Fitzwater, he brings round. He does big round delts, full three-dimensional. If you compare them that way, he does win. But then you look at the overall package and... Good Vito, he's very peeled in that sense. He's very separated in that juncture. In the midsection, wow, both of these guys, as soon as I seen them both, I thought to myself, 
these guys are one and two. And Justin Rodriguez, he didn't stand a chance. And then, and of course, they did it all over again. They switched them around, and both guys seemed to get harder and grainier as the poses, you know, progressed. So this is the pre-judging for your 2024 Detroit Pro. What a great backdrop. What a great showing. I mean, these guys brought it. These guys brought it. Who Who's winning after, after pre-judging? Hmm, I don't know, man. I kind of have good veto, even though I am a Martin Fitzwater, what do they call it, a fan person? Too old to be a boy. <laughs> a fan person. But I like good veto, too. And that's, I'm going to give you my honest opinion, I think. Good veto, just maybe by a, just a lemon slice. But it's that close that it is a tie, and Martin Fitzwater could come on strong in the finals, and I look forward to that. Hit thumbs up on the video. Let me know who you have winning. Detroit Pro. Have a great one.